Welcome back to another What's In There video where I take a game and show you what exactly comes in the box before you make that purchase. So this time it's not an actual game, it's an expansion to the game. One of the, one of the best Walking Dead games that's out there, uh, The Walking Dead No Sanctuary, put out by Cryptozoic. This one specifically is the Killer Within expansion where they're going to be delving into the prison, one of my favorite seasons. So uh, we're going to go ahead and get down to the table, I'm going to show you everything that comes in the box, and then we'll come back after that in just a few moments. So as we dive into the box, the expansion box for the Killer Within expansion for No Sanctuary, the board game uh, put out by Cryptozoic. Uh, you have the rules changes. Looks like there's a perimeter change. Darkness now, our special rules. Um, there's a couple of uh, reference charts. Infection, okay. Interesting, interesting. And this looks like it's in the prison, of course, infected, where they're all getting kind of sick. And uh, the killer within. And those are, that was such a good season. Um, everybody's sick in this one. Really like those, these uh, boards, though. They look really good. And then seed. Huh. All right. Well, these are the different uh, scenarios that uh, they have with them. Uh, what are some of the things here? It says, survivor may discard objective while... Um, no, we'll look at that later. So here are the different uh, double-sided boards. So let's look at these. And then you have the guard tower. That's cool. Yeah. Neato Frito. Oh, this is the uh, cafeteria. Cool. All right, super. So those are good. Uh, we have some breach tokens and pressure tokens. So these are popping. Eh, they pr probably could come out a little bit easier, but that's all right. So that's that. Those are coming out pretty good. What are the new characters here? Let's see. We've got Michonne. That's always a good thing. One of my favorite characters. That's cool. Tyrese. Man, I miss Tyrese. Um, <laughs> not very good interacting with people. This is true. Um, and Carol, good old Carol, really good at talking to people. All right, these are all the allies sides of them, of course. Carl, and then the rival prisoners. All righty, so then get rid of that, and we kind of pop that open. And of course, we've got all of the different cards. All right, so let's take those event cards out. Wow, a lot of event cards. A Riot Walker reference card, and that's cool. All right, so let's start back here. Carl, sneak off. Uh, Carl's deck here. Then Carol's inspiring calm. <laughs> Tooth and nail. She's ready to fight Tooth and nail. That is very true. Michonne, flawless execution. Flawless victory. That's cool. Brutal taming. Yes. Methodical patience. On guard. Flash of steel. Conserving ammo. Cool. Tyrese, buy in time. Reinforce. Stand guard. If it isn't nailed down, framing hammer. Yep. And post watch. All right. Cool. And then we also have some event cards. So. Wow, that's a lot of event cards. Good night in the morning. Okay. And uh, well, this is the uh, Riot Gear Walker reference card. If a figure is defeated, it is knocked down instead. If already knocked down, it is defeated as normal. So with Michonne here, she is a master swordsman. Once per activation, you may discard one of your survivor tokens to defeat one enemy in your space. That's cool. She has a three, one, and two for her stats down here, so that's pretty good. And the model is also a very nice looking model. Uh, a lot of good detail in there. The uh, sword is a little bit uh, bendy, but that's okay. That can be fixed with just a little bit of warm water. Uh, but this is the... Uh, um, I guess you could say the original Michonne, so to speak. So a lot of good detail in there, and it looks really cool. Carol's ability here is uh, to console people. Once during his or her activation, a survivor within range 2 of your space may discard one of your survivor tokens and one survivor 
card to replace that card with one from his or her exertion pile. So that's a pretty cool idea. You can uh, siphon back out of your discard pile uh, some cards that you use. One, two, three are her uh, abilities there. Now she has a little bit of a different pose than the picture suggests. She's carrying a, you know, the pocket knife here, but then she's got a rifle in her hand uh, for the actual model. So there's a little bit of a discrepancy there, but that's all right, no big deal. Um, but again, pretty good model. Not spectacular, really kind of a static pose, and I'm not a big fan of static poses, but it looks good. And good old Tyrese here. We have a perimeter check. Each time a survivor places a barricade, that survivor may discard one of your survivor tokens to place one additional barricade for free. That's cool. Uh, so you're bolstering up your defenses there. Three, two, one for the uh, different... Uh, abilities there. Uh, his uh, model is pretty much spot on with uh, the artistry here, so that's pretty cool. Um, he has a pretty cool stance. There's a lot of action there. Uh, he's stepping forward. He's swinging that hammer. He's got his arm up to maybe fend off some would-be um, walkers trying to get a, you know, a snack or something to that effect, but uh, this is a really neat model. And then we have Carl uh, with his survival, survivor ability of Reassure. Once per turn, a survivor in your space may discard one of your survivor tokens to discard one stress. So that's pretty cool. He has a calming fee, uh, uh, thing. He's straight across the board twos. So that's pretty cool. He's very even keeled. Uh, the model is pretty close to the uh, artistry over here too. That big old 10 gallon cowboy hat uh, that uh, belonged to Rick. And so his model is pretty good there. Kind of a static pose again, but uh, it is a thematic pose, I guess, for this time frame. And here we have the uh, prisoners. When they are defeated, you reduce the threat by one. That's cool. Uh, if it is a green uh, space, then it's moved two spaces away from the nearest survivor and raised the threat by one unless one survivor in line of sight exerts one. Uh, yellow is the lower threat by one, and one survivor on this rival's tile suffers one stress. All right, and then move three spaces on red toward the nearest survivor. Then one survivor in this rival's space must exert two. Wow. Or raise threat by two. Well, that's not very nice at all. Uh, but uh, again, a neat rival to come into the fray with. And, and the model, of course, is uh, pretty good. It definitely matches the artwork on the character sheet, but uh, it's not specific to any of the actual prisoners that were in, at least not that I recognize. I don't recognize this guy from uh, the show, but uh, it's just kind of a gener generic representation of the prisoners. So uh, that's that's a cool a cool model. So now you have the Riot Gear Walkers. These guys were pretty nasty when they uh, ambushed the, our, our heroes at the, at the prison. And uh, as we, we talked about before, it says that uh, when it's defeated, it's knocked down. It's not actually defeated. But if it was already knocked down, then it would be defeated as normal. And of course, these models are pretty good as well, indicative of, of uh, what that uh, ambush looked like in the show. So uh, I think they did a good job with the model here um, with all the riot gear out there. They don't have the helmet, which I think is unfortunate. But um, you know, what can you do? You can't have your cake and eat it too all the time. So that is that. You know everything that comes in the box now, uh, and you have seen pretty much close-ups of all the models as well. So now you have a little bit of idea, a uh, better idea rather, of whether or not you're going to add this to your The Walking Dead No Sanctuary board game collection. And that's pretty much my entire purpose in making this video, is just to show you what you're going to get with your hard-earned money. Well, thanks for joining me. I certainly appreciate it. We're going to get on out of here. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys and gals on the flip side. Take care now.